Hey guys, welcome to Voice Bootcamp. This is Faisal Khan, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to install UCCE based software. Before you can configure a server to be acting as a router logger or admin server, you need to have a base software installed. Now, the base software can only be installed once you have completed all the uh, earlier preparation plus your SQL server has been configured properly. So for that, please take a look at the previous lab number two on how to prepare SQL server. So assume that SQL server has been completed. Now what you want to do is go to your CD-ROM where your distributions are for uh, ICM or UCCE. You want to go to setup. And you want to start the UC Cisco Unified uh, CCE installer. Now installer will do a check to make sure the server is uh, ready for uh, to meet the requirement so if you click on next it will kind of go through a SQL server uh, validations It's going to check any other so operating system validation such as the service pack updates that needs and so and so now we are going to do a fresh install we're not going to do an upgrade and uh, in the fresh install we're going to continue it's going to ask you for the location of the release now we don't have the update release at this stage However, in one of the lab uh, later in this course, I'm going to show you how to update the maintenance release. So go ahead and continue. Location where you want to install your uh, server and if you want to secure the SQL server. So at this stage, click on install and you are almost done. So approximately take 25 minutes to complete it. So sit back, relax, and watch it complete its installation. Okay, so you can see the installation has been completed. Now we're going to reboot the system. Okay, so after rebooting the system, we're lo logging back into the server. So once the installation is done, you should see a couple of new icons on your desktop, such as a Unified CE Service Control, Unified CCE Tools, and then of course Unified CCE uh, setup web setup now these are the uh, base software uh, I sorry, the components that are installed during the base software now after you have this, uh, done this then we're going to start configuring the role of the server such as router logger or uh, PG admin server so and so all right so that's pretty much it for this particular lab